So with the asphalt grade quality, there really are only two types of asphalt made. You have standard oxidized asphalt and then you have polymer modified asphalt. So standard asphalt is how it's typically always been done where you take asphalt and you end up hardening that and it goes through the oxidation process. That's important because if you did not harden up your asphalt, it would essentially roll off your uh, roof like molasses in the summertime. So by hardening your shingle, you're able to keep its form, but you're aging the shingle. So when your shingle is installed on your roof, it's already partially aged. When you go through the oxidation process, you put this asphalt in these tanks that go through heating and cooling, and you recycle that over and over until you attain the right type of rigidity. Not inherently anything wrong with that, but there's a better way to do it. Malarkey Roofing Products has made their polymer modified asphalt. And that is important because polymer modified asphalt is a higher grade technology, higher quality asphalt. What they do is they mix it with rubber and plastic polymers that makes it not only rubberized, it's more of a synthetic material. There's many benefits to it where it can give you a higher impact rating. It can give better granule adhesion. It can just be more flexible and withstand the hot and cold temperature variants. There are many benefits to it, but that's not necessarily how we graded it as a yes, no, pass, fail versus is it polymer modified or not. But that's important to know because having that technology injected into your shingles gives it a longer lifespan. You look on the website for any of the manufacturers, they will say that it is actually a higher quality grade. So I want to point out Malarkey Roofing Products as the clear winner. You can see in the results that how it affects everything from granule loss to the impact rating to the bonding itself. The Malarkey Roofing Products made every single shingle in their line polymer modified. Fun fact, it's the most popular shingle in Alaska in the cold climate. They ended up finding a way to mass produce this and make it very efficiently. So you find this all over and it's very important to have it in a colder climate because it's more resistant to cracking when you run into the cold temperatures in the winter time and it stays flexible then in the summertime. So polymer modified asphalt is rubberized to give you longer lifespan and it costs a little bit more, but it's not out of the extreme price category. The other manufacturers do have a polymer modified option. They try to replicate what Malarkey Roofing Products has done specifically. However, the price point is significant where you're talking anywhere from three to $5,000 more just for that product. So when we're offering you the best value or better bang for your buck, that's what we mean.